Yo, hey, have I ever told you about Rhonda and Tom? Hello there. Rhonda is a compulsive liar. Tom, how's it going? Is a Tony Danza stand-in. This is their story. <laughs> this film came out in 1978. 73 minutes long. Our file is like 620, but then I looked at it without the credits. This is five minutes. This is five minutes long. This is the last of the littles. I don't know, who cares? We open with a meat cue, and that's almost the entire film, this little meat cue. Shoveling snow. You don't see many outdoor exterior snow landscapes in adult films. Well, you see a whole bunch of it this time. And a little meat cue. We got Tony Danza and Compulsive Liar, and they're just doing their thing. He's trying to mac. She's trying to who knows what. She's got guys coming over later. But she keeps falling down? I don't know. She falls down. She falls down. He falls down. Everyone falls down. Would you like to see a movie where people fall down? Not starring Michael Douglas. I am Jason from Barefoot. All right, let's get into this. This is Squeaky Clean Adult Films. It's going to be a short intro. It's going to be a short outro. It's a short movie. It's a midweek drop. I'm going to be talking in the back of the film as well. Just go there. I know a place. Beautiful couple. Yeah, I guess we did. Thanks for the lift. <laughs> hey, need any help? I'd love some. I'm stuck. Here you go. Ready? I guess. Come here. Oh. Let's try again. One, two, three. Oops. Oh, well, I guess if at first you can't succeed... Give up? I never give up. Here we go. Oh, thanks. Anytime. Hey, what's your name? Rhonda. What's yours? Tom. Hello. Thank you. Always glad to help out a beautiful woman like yourself. You're a real charmer. Well, bye. Gotta go now. Tom, care for some hot chocolate? Sure. So you're a football player, and you're trying to work your way through college? Among other things. What about yourself? Oh, I'm just starting to teach grammar school. That's all. I've led kind of a boring life compared to yours.
This is really nice. Yes, this is a nice room, isn't it? Allow me to show you the room. This is the bed. This is the closet. And this is the bathroom. Ah, oh, yes, the most important room of all. Get ready for me, honey. I'll be out in a second. Cheapskate. Oh, I'm sorry he didn't give you a tip. Oh, that's all right, ma'am. It's not your fault. He's so nervous, he probably forgot. I wish there was something I could do. And the milkman, I almost forgot. He'll be here to get paid just after you leave tomorrow. Oh, yes. Then I've got to walk the dog with Mr. K around 1 o'clock. Oh, no. I forgot my dentist appointment. How am I going to squeeze them all in? You'll do it. Now get some sleep. Good night, honey. Good night. All right, what did you think? What did you think? I kind of like it. Shot on film, looks good. This was a X-rated motion picture. We got it down to the squeakiest it can get. G, money. Samantha Fox is our lying lead. David Morris is our Tony Danza. John Christopher made this movie, wrote, directed, and edited. He even put it on the title card. I think most people would have thrown the editor a little, a little, a little ways away and then just put right in directed by. But he pulled a Rodriguez way before Rodriguez or a John Sayles or a Kevin Smith. And he just put edited right up in his main title card. Between 1973 and 1985, this cat made 25, 25, 28. He made 28 movies. His last film was posthumous because he passed away early, young. This is a very wordy movie. It is very script driven. It's script driven and wordy. <clears throat> the documentary called X-Rated, Greatest Adult Movies of All Time. I need to rewatch that. I saw it when it first came out, but this is in it. I don't remember it from it. I remember it from like 10 minutes ago of research telling me that the, this was in that. It's on Showtime. Joey Silvera's in this. It's so awesome. He's just like kind of a background key, pl key, key player, player here. He's just in the audience. He's at the wedding and he's just in the background, legit. And he looks kind of, um, he looks kind of gangster. If you remember Joey Silvera in the 70s, it was more like gangster. Sketchy, sketchy looking, shady, unsavory. All right, guys, thanks for watching. <clears throat> we have a PayPal button. If you want to donate to it, do it. If you don't, then do that. Don't subscribe, don't like, don't share, just watch. I'm gonna go. I feel like my allergies are flaring up. 
it always happens around this time of the month um, when the snow is here. Thanks for watching.